too much light. Sparks fly. And around he goes. Here's a, here's a different angle. See the safety trucks up top? I mean, it just exploded. When it hit it, it just exploded. And he was traveling at a high rate of speed, oh, yeah. trying to catch back trying up to catch at the, the back of the field. Toya climbs away, and the driver of the safety truck was up from his vehicle, walked down the bank and, and away. We have some audio from one fellow on Toya. Evidently, you know, he was talking about maybe the vibration in every gear. It's like they were maybe trying to look and see if they had a rear end problem or something. That's the reason this crew member is sitting there trying to rotate the tire back and forth, and they're looking underneath in the drivetrain area. And then he pulled off pit road, tried to gain speed down the back stretch, and catch up to the pack under the caution flag. Look, he, look how hot that was. And that's, I guarantee, and that's where he slammed into it. And the most important thing, everyone is all right. Now, that truck was up against the safer barrier, which is steel, but is backed by foam blocks, which have doubtless taken a hit from the heat of that fire. And the big question right now is what kind of shape is the racing surface in that was aflame after this strange crash down at turn number three. Fuel, you can see fuel still running out of that tank. It's 200 gallons in there. It's still running down the hill. While they clean this up in turn three, and the cars are stopped on the backstretch under the red flag. Let's go down to John Roberts and Michael Waltrip for a race recap.